All right, we're going to attempt to fix this jack. The jack is used in our press, purchased many years ago, but that sticker seems to say, if I can read it correctly, $99.99. So $100. And I noticed on uh, Harbor Freight recently they have a different brand of jack, but it is still $100 for a 30 ton jack. Right now this thing has uh, been in service for a long time, but it hasn't been used a lot recently. And so it does jack things up a little bit here. Oops. Help if I get the camera. But then it stops. And it just won't go anymore. We're going to try to fix this thing. See if we can figure out what's wrong and why the oil won't flow inside like it's supposed to. So I think the thing that's going wrong is that there's probably a seal or maybe the plunger inside the um, this little plunger, the seal on the little plunger is not holding like it should. That's my guess. Um, so we're going to try to take that apart and see if uh, that seal is just dried out in there or just what. I'm going to start by pulling this interesting key. All right, I'll set that aside. Interesting. So there's our little plunger. And my suspicion is that it's that seal right there. But I'm not seeing any reason that that seal is bad. Okay, it looks like overkill, but hey. Yep, it definitely does come undone. I'm just doing a very close inspection of the end of this thing. It looks like there's some debris down in there, which is a little bit concerning. I don't know what all that is. I wonder if that's a seal or used to be a seal. Huh. That seal's been a little bit damaged there. Suppose that's possible. Still seeing a lot of debris in there. Yep, there's a screen on it, and that screen has. Hmm, don't know if I can seen in the video or not. But kind of a bunch of debris. How did debris get in there? There's some metal debris. There's a lot of metal debris actually. So just for reference, I worked for a mechanic for a number of years, and he told me the key to being a good mechanic is being cleaner than a doctor. And I said, what? Cleaner than a doctor? A doctor, a surgeon's got to be really clean. He says, no, 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 no. Doctors get to bury their mistakes. You get to eat yours. 
So I thought about that and said, yeah, okay, I understand. There's a lot of debris in here. That's going to have to be cleaned out with solvent. My hands are just f full of grit, like little metal. All right, let's have a nice close look at what's going on inside of there. The oil looks really clean. I'll have to use a magnet and pull out what grit we can out of the oil. Some little nicks on the inside of that really poor machining. I guess that's what you expect for a hundred dollar. These seals are quite dry. They're a little, f the, the rubber is kind of flaking off of them. Again, looking at machine quality here. Not what I would say high quality machine parts. You can see a lot of surface finish issues there. Um, the face that actually does the seal is not too bad, which is interesting. You did a good job on that. The rest of the machine is crappy. Looks like a sleeve that they put on the inside of this thing that has the nice finish for the uh, bore. This piece went in second and it has got a groove on it that looks like it came from that. I'll bet those two match. And I'll bet they'll never seal properly again. Probably should have Put this in there first. Didn't that just slide in? Pretty sure that just slid out. It did just uh, slide in, slide out, but if I put it in like that, it's going to end up with a great big air bubble. Yeah. I think I would rather minimize that. Okay, that's pretty amazing. I didn't think that was going to fix it. Since we got some action and it seems like it's working again, it may not be totally fixed, but give it a shot. Maybe it'll work, maybe it won't. Alright, key's back on. It's a nice key once it's on, pretty obnoxious to get there. Something inside is not moving very smoothly, it keeps popping. Sixteenth of an inch. We're pushing that pin out, that was something we couldn't get it to do the other day. Take a hammer but it's definitely moving that pin. I love it. <laughs>